I'm just saying what American Catholics feel, what American Catholics perceive, and what a lot of American Catholics are afraid to articulate. And there's a lot of frustration and a sense of deep betrayal. And I don't think Pope Francis or the Vatican Curia understand that, perceive that, or acknowledge it. Instead, what we see from Pope Francis is this schismatic mentality, this rigid mentality in the United States, and they take it personally instead of understanding it pastorally, which they always claim, we're pastoral, we're pastoral, you got to be pastoral. But the, the greatest pastoral wound in the American Catholic heart is the betrayal and the mismanagement of the Cardinal McCarrick crimes. And, and the Cardinal McCarrick crimes don't stand alone. That is an icon. That is a meme of the repeated examples in the newspapers. I mean, we had one just in Dallas within the last month or two of yet another priest who was credibly accused of molesting girls and was removed. I don't know how that's gone for, but it's just a kick in the gut. And I'll just be honest as a Texan, it's a kick in the balls to have this over and over again. And the McCarrick narrative shows that Rome didn't take it seriously. Rome keeps brushing it under the rug. And for us to see an archbishop, all right, Catholics revere the offices, an archbishop, Vigano, who was apostolic annuncio, so he was the lifeline between Rome and the bishops of the United States, to see that person come out in the public and say, here's what I've seen, here's where the abuses are, and I can't remain quiet anymore. For the sake of my own salvation, I have to come out and say it. The hearts of American Catholics, whether you think Vigano is too radical or not, they're like, finally. It's not one of our own American bishops, but it's an it's a archbishop connected to American Catholicism. Finally, somebody said something and, and revealed the inner workings, the inner mechanisms. Like we saw how the, how the nasty sausage was made. And then just to be disappointed with how McCarrick was, was handled. And the United States bishops, you know, they, they voted not to do the investigation. Bishop Strickland was the only one who stood up and articulated it and said, you know, I think it also has to do with the problem with same-sex attraction within not only the priesthood, but the episcopate. And then what did we American Catholics experience? Pastoral accompaniment, as we're told by the Jesuits constantly? No. Then Strickland was canceled. So if you're a non-American Catholic watching this and you kind of want to understand how, how does Taylor Marshall think and how do uh, Catholic Americans think and what are the wounds, what are the concerns? These are the wounds and concerns. I know this is going to be a big story, but I would beg people in the Vatican to either explain what I'm trying to explain now live on YouTube to Pope Francis or to show at least clip out this segment, the last five, 10 minutes of what I've said, show that to Pope Francis. Say, do you realize that you're dealing with a wounded demographic that is huge? And have you as a pastor, as a shepherd, as a priest, as a vicar of Christ, responsibly ministered to these people? Or have you beaten them down? Do they feel unheard? Do they feel ridiculed? And why is it that they would feel so much filial veneration for Archbishop Vigano in the United States? Is it just because we're waspy or we're Anglophone or because we're cowboys down in Texas or we're rebellious, we're independent-minded, we're entrepreneurial, we're whatever they want to call us, capitalists, rigid. As a father, I got eight kids. All right, we have eight children, beautiful children. You know, when, when one of your children are hurting, calling them names or pulling down some discipline on them doesn't work. You have to seek to understand your children. I'm, I'm just talking as a dad right now. You have to seek to understand the way your children are thinking, the way your children are perceiving a situation. Often children think this is not fair. Sometimes you just say, well, life isn't fair. But, but, on, but deeper than that is, is you want your children to thrive. I want all my children, all eight of my children to be 
more holy than me, have greater faith than me, greater charity, to love the poor more than me, to to have, you know, a deeper devotion to the Mass and a, and a deeper devotion to even the Holy Father and the Pope. I want all my children to excel beyond me, right? It's not just that I want to have a legacy. I love them, and I want them to, to experience life and Christianity and Christ in a deeper and more beautiful way than I have. My wife and I tell them, we want y'all, we want to do whatever we can to set y'all up to be even better than us. Like that's, that's what we do as parents. And I just sense in the church, and again, I'm speaking from the heart here. I sense in the church that the priests, the bishops, the cardinals, and yes, even Pope Francis, they don't care. And they're frustrated and they're annoyed with us. All right. So Pope Francis, if you're watching, Cardinals, if you're watching, this is the story. This is the feeling. So in order for you to understand Archbishop Vigano in his place in the narrative, you need to understand what is being experienced because so many of the United States dioceses have gone bankrupt. I don't know what the number is. Hundreds of millions. I think we're in the billions, but I'll just say hundreds of millions of dollars that have been donated by the Catholic lay people, by the Catholic grandmas and grandpas, and the working class fathers and mothers who are putting money in the plate, money in the basket, and are writing those $1,000, $5,000, $10,000 checks to the annual bishop appeal, diocesan appeal, seeing the diocese go bankrupt, seeing churches close, seeing yet another sexual abuse crisis, another payout, more lawyers taking more money. It hurts so bad. And the only one that we have seen in America to be vocal about it was Archbishop Vigano. And then later, Bishop Strickland. 